We're hoping for an all-action slugfest. He's dropped the guard now. What do you think of that decision? Good counter punching. Perfect punch. All hands on deck. We are witnessing an up. Knocked down hard. I'm not sure that they're going to be able to get back on their feet here as the referee continues the count. Oh, my goodness. I want to see that one more time. You're right, Todd. What a shot. One, two, three, four, five, six. So back into the fray again, but how much do they have left? Should have looked at this corner, look at the they're trying to calm down, make the most of the count, get up three, then move, get behind the referee, save yourself a bit of time. They just need to make their way back to the corner, somehow get to the end of the round. Need to pick things up here in the second half of the round. It's that for ever hope. Remember the fight at Ivan Holyfield? He could be behind them. Where was the defense? Why weren't they covering up? Why weren't they more cautious? right back into the fray. Green Days now needs to steady the pace. Get the pace back to normal. Nice counter. He misses with that jab. Not so tense anymore. Trying to loosen things up. I like it. Not the best of rounds with 10 seconds to go. And there's the bell to start the round. Try to get the momentum shift coming their way. What can they do here? That knockdown we just saw was a heavy knockdown. I'd be very, very surprised if he'll come out fresh as a daisy. That's not going to happen. He's going to help somebody. He's going he's to bluff him. Welcome you to this beautiful theater. Shakespeare has nothing on the drama that we've seen between these two fighters. We expect a standing ovation when these two are done. This is that place you want to say, I fought that, I think that. And now we are here. Why weren't they more cautious? And they're down just when you thought it couldn't get any worse. I want to see that again, but from a different angle. Shot from the gods, they say. A shot from the gods. to keep this fighter down. Todd, he's up. I, I'd be surprised if he makes it back to the corner. And if he does, will he get back up on the stool again? That was a shot. Throws the jab, but it doesn't score. Now going to get a little more loosey-goosey. Let's see how this one feels. Punch, counter punch. This may do it. It's all coming to an end. They ring the bell and here we go. They really got banged up last round. What can they do here to change the momentum? What a heavy knockdown. How are they going to come back from that? They've staggered back to the corner. They've got to freshen them up, alert them again, get them back on point again. This round, they've got to coast the round. Don't get involved. Give yourself another three minutes to get your head through. If you're a 
your counter puncher, then basically you do the counter attack. You let them get their punch off first, and then you answer in time. If you're fighting a counter puncher, you've got a dummy shot. Make them react from that, then react them. I know it's hard to think that way, but counter punchers, they're watching, watching your every move. Both of these fighters have had their moments. Someone tell these two that they can be defensive for a minute if they want to. Perfectly matched. Skill for skill. Tap for tap. Now this fight will say, you know what, I'm just that notch above you. And so I've got to respect both of them more than happy. Trying to fight like Roy Jones Jr. now, bouncing on the toes. Like a little, an upset of the year, perhaps, right before our eyes. A very competitive round with 10 seconds left. A perfect counter shot. They ring the bell, and here we go. Not the start that they wanted, but let's see what they can do in this round. They've had one minute to recover. Now they've got to bluff it. They've got to bluff it. They've got to come out now and style it out. Get on the back foot. Jab. Rest on the jab. Be smart and pop until your legs come back. Then, put the pressure on. Trying to buy time. It appears that the moment of trouble has passed, at least for now. What caught sweeping on the job? What you do, you step back. Step Whoa, wait a minute! What a shot! Whoa, and you saw the balance. And the referee will begin the count. Ten seconds to get up. I don't see any movement here. It looks like this one's going to be over. Blink and you miss it. Good thing we can watch that over and over again. I've got to see that again. to get back up on his feet, but is he just a glutton for punishment? He's got to waste time. Get step behind the referee. When he comes close, tie him up. The referee's then got to call you. And we may see an early stoppage here. It appears he's out of trouble, at least for now. But that just goes to... And a wise move there to clinch. I don't know if it's a dancing competition or a fight. Just when you think they're gonna have a look. They're happy this round's coming to an end. 10 seconds left, an illegal move there. We're hoping for an all-action slugfest. He got knocked down in the last round. Let's see what he can do here. What a knockdown. One minute, you need one hour to get over a shot like that. Now it's down to conditioning. Now it's down to mental strength and preparation is how you are going to do with it. Johnny, a lot of fighters focus on their defense with their hands up. This fighter focuses on their defense with their footwork, moving on those angles, staying out of danger. If you're an outside fighter, you've got to use that straight jab, the straight right hands, the straight left hands. Doing it that way, it makes it so awkward for anybody to try and pin you down or even predict which way you're moving. Oh, what a punch! Better be careful, the referee may take a point if he keeps flinching. Now, sometimes style makes fight, but this one, the styles just seem to be clashing. These two are the perfect dance partners. A very close match. It shows the skill, the discipline, the respect both fighters have for each other because no one dare do anything out of turn. Missing with that jab. He 
through the uppercut, but did not score. That punch lands. How about that time counter shot? You know the scorecards are going to be all over the place in this one. And there's the bell to start the round. Coming off that fantastic last round, let's see if he can keep his momentum going. Todd, my motto is, if it's not broken, why change it? An excellent last round, everything works. Wait for the reaction. Until then, keep doing what you've just been doing because you've won that hands down. You're not going to see as much footwork as the smaller weight classes in the heavyweight division, but we don't care. We want the heavy fist. Fantastic punch. So far, both of these fighters have had their moments. He had his moment, but has it gone by? It's been a tough round so far. It's been a tough, tough round. What do they do? What a time on the I don't know. How are they going to get through this? Now they've got to wake up. They've got to get on the back foot, clear the head a little bit, then jump back into it again. A chance to make history. Looks like they've shaken it off. What we could we see? And at some point, the court... And they're down, trying to make it up before 10 as the referee continues the count. He knew his chin would get tested in this fight, and it failed him miserably. A shot from the gods took him out. So time to go celebrate after another knockout win here. What a build-up. What a journey towards this fight. What a fight itself. The crowd enjoyed it. The fighters enjoyed it. I certainly enjoyed it. And what a way to end the fight. There's no mistake there about who won. What a shot.